that's a big one. Oh my word. What is going on guys? So right now I'm headed to Choctawachee Bay. I think that's how you say it. And I'm gonna be fishing for sharks, redfish, whatever can bite. Maybe if we're lucky, we can catch some bait, some big shark bait to take over to East Pass. And East Pass is the inlet that goes from the ocean to Crab Island. And I've caught some sharks there in the past, so hopefully we can get some bait and catch some big fish. Oh, oh, there he is again, guys. There he is again. Got him. There we go, guys. <laughs> Got the stingray. I got the stingray. This little ray. <sighs> there he goes. All right, guys, we got another stingray. Okay. I thought it was the same one coming back and forth, but there's a bunch of them. So I think I'm gonna get some Googling done, do a Google search and figure out if I can use these for shark bait. Yeah, there's like a ton of them. I don't know why. This is like really far back in the bay, but what do I know? I've, I barely have ever fished here. All right, guys, we did some, some Googling. We went online and these guys are legal to keep and i don't like killing animals but this would be very good shark bait so we're going to put him out of his misery very quickly and then we are going to use him off the jetties uh, later when it gets dark all right guys took him out quickly just bonked him on the head i'm not gonna lie i hated doing that i really hope he catches me a monster shark because i feel awful You gotta move faster, bro. It's underwater. Yo! He caught it in the air in his mouth. All right, you guys, I cut up that stingray. I cut off each of the wings. I'm putting one on each shark rod. And right now we are at the inlet that comes in from the ocean into Choctawachee Bay. I think that's how I say it. So uh, hopefully we can catch a monster. All right, so I was casting off of the rocks, and as soon as the uh, stingray hit the water, I lost the shark. The hook went back into the bait, so he didn't get hooked. But uh, tide's really, really strong. It's going way to the right. It's hard to get baits out, so I'm going to cast this one on this nine-foot spinning rod. Should be able to get it out pretty far. It sucks that the water's so rough, but I'm going to try to make it work. the water's high because these rocks that aren't slippery they don't have any algae are getting wet oh oh guys 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 we got fish we got fish we got fish yep yep we got a fish let's get the harness on i don't think he's on man he pulled out a lot of line all right guys we got one we got one we've got a shark yes we do or something we 
got something. All right, guys, I just kayaked out a bait about right where I casted that line. And this is 80 pound mono to 100 pound braid. So hopefully that doesn't happen again. All right, guys, we oh, got one. We oh, got one. Oh, yeah. There we go. Uh, already. Got the harness on, thankfully. Let's put it on. Okay. Round two. This is definitely another really big fish. What kind of shark is that? Oh, I think it's a bull. A bull shark. I think. Damn, that's a beast. Woo -hoo -hoo. Let's go. Look at that fish, y'all. Let's get this harness off, get this fish out of here. Is that a bull shark? Ow. All right, guys, first shark of the night. Finally got one and really needed this fish after losing that one, fighting it for over 40 minutes. So awesome to get this dude in. We're going to get him out of here. Oh, no way. He is like a infection from losing another hook or another hook being in him. Let me get the bolt cutters. There we go. He had another hook in his mouth that came out. That's where that defection is, right there. All right, buddy, I'm gonna get you in the water. Oh gosh, he's ready. He's ready to go. Look at him. He's slapping me. Oh, he's too shallow, he's too shallow. You might need help. He's tangled. See you, buddy. Dude, he bit as soon as the bait was down there. So I'm gonna see if I can get one more and then we can probably just like go. I'm fine with that. There we go, guys. Oh my gosh. That's a big one. Oh my word. Holy smokes. Gosh, guys, this is a monster. I didn't even change the drag since that last fish. Can you grab that buckle? Ugh. Okay, wow. Thank you, sir. I'm not using a shock leader other than my uh, 80 pound mono, so let's hope that's good enough. Oh my word. Okay, that's a big fish. Ugh. 
Get up, get up, get up, get up. Okay, okay, there we go. All right. I think it's bigger than the last one. All right, guys, fish number two of the night. I, I'd say this guy's bigger than the first one. Awesome fish. Uh, I'm exhausted. We're gonna call it on this one and uh, get out of here. Alright guys, that sums up this video. Incredible night fishing. I think that second shark I caught may have been the biggest I've ever caught. Not in length, but maybe the heaviest. I mean, that was a big fish. So, as always, thank you guys for watching, and I will see y'all in the next fishing video.